In this video, we will discuss set builder notation. So far, we've introduced two ways of describing a set, either with a complete sentence or using roster form. The third method for describing a set is called set builder notation, where we use a single variable as a stand in for all elements that meet certain properties. We can express set builder notation like this. Note that the vertical bar between the x and the properties of x is a stand-in for the phrase such that. When using set builder notation, the properties of the element x are displayed as a list, or if there are only two properties, commonly we separate these with the word and. There is no limit to the number or type of properties that the variable x must have to fit into this set. These properties are determined purely by the set you are trying to construct. For example, properties could be x is even, at least one digit of x is 3, x is not prime, or x is greater than 5. Here are some examples of how we can use set builder notation to construct various sets. The second and fourth examples we have seen in previous videos. So let's discuss their set builder notations now. Recall from a previous video that the set zn or z mod n are all of the integers starting at 0 all the way up to n minus 1, where n is a natural number that is provided. There are two ways to express zn in set builder notation. The first, we can write x such that x is in z and 0 is less than or equal to x is less than or equal to n minus 1. Equivalently, we could say x such that x is in z, and 0 is less than or equal to x, which is less than n. For the fourth example, recall that we can express the even integers in roster form as the numbers 0, 2, 4, 6, and so on, as well as negative 2, negative 4, negative 6, and so on. In set builder notation, we would say x such that x is in z and x mod 2 is equal to 0. Set builder notation is an easy way to express a set without having to know all or some of its elements. As long as you know the properties of that set, you can express the entire set given a single placeholder variable. Try writing the following four sets using set builder notation. Here are the set builder notations for each of the example problems.